uh, is is the character here, uh, and Gideon is preparing to fight. He's preparing uh, for war. Uh, and before you go to war, I want you to understand that I'm going to walk real heavy now. Keep telling me and hope you got your pen and pencil. Before you go in war, you always have to consider your history. You got to have to consider your history. You have to consider when you are about to face a battle. You got to consider your history. You got to consider that the same God that brought you out before is the same God that brings you out now. You got to consider that He will be made away from you before. He's going to make a way for you now. The reason why David had so much confidence when he fought the lion is because in his history he had already won the bed. In his history he had already won the lion. So when he came to the lion, he had already had progress and the victory he was used to victory. See, God is looking for some people who are used to victory. The iron is used to a whole bunch of losers. So I don't go with the stuff with my head down. I go with my head up because I'm going to win every time. If anybody ever Yeah. 
All right, so he had all this pain now because he not only cut down the altars, but he also cut down the groves, things that could pull him back into the same situation. Things that can pull him back in the same situation. You being pulled back into the same situation that you were in last year because you didn't cut down the groves. You think that because it's been a year, it's okay now to be in his presence. But you can't go around him because you still ain't healed for what he did for you last year. The message that will prove you. I walk by faith. I walk by what I believe. 